Hello, my friends. Welcome. Thank you for joining me today for these few moments with our Good Shepherd. Our reading is from James chapter 2, reading verse 22. You see that his faith was working together with his works, and by his works his faith was shown to be complete. I heard about a groundbreaking ceremony for a new church. Unlike most of groundbreaking ceremonies, they didn't use a golden shovel. They used an old farm plow. And the farm plow was sitting there in the field, and some members of the youth group first picked up the rope and started pulling. But the plow didn't move. Then some elders joined in in grabbing the rope and helped pull. But the plow stood still. Finally, the whole congregation grabbed the rope and started pulling together. And the plow moved and the ground was broken. I thought that was really a neat idea and a, and a great picture for how we in the church are to be working together. Think of what we could accomplish in our churches, our communities, even our own homes, if we just pulled together. So why don't we? Well, some people don't want to get their hands dirty. Some pull in different directions. And others just don't give it much effort, don't give it their all. And how sad that is compared to our Redeemer who did get his hands dirty, who pulled with his heavenly Father, and who very definitely gave it his all. So what should we do about it? Well, don't wait for me, and I'm not going to wait for you. Let's just grab the rope together and start pulling together. And we will accomplish great things under God's blessings for his church. We pray. O Holy Spirit, move each of us, including me, to put out our hand put to put our hands to the plow and pull together to work for your kingdom. For by such teamwork we give you glory. Amen. Well, thank you, everyone. May God bless you as you take that rope in your hands and begin pulling with all your teammates for the glory of God.